Recording in time intervals. In Bird 4, we can choose to launch a continuous recording, or we can assist the software to record in certain time intervals. To launch this, go to the Controls panel and click the Recording Settings. Recording by time intervals is available in the raw recording mode. To activate it, click BRW file here in the pathway. The default protocol is set to basic, which is a continuous recording. Click to open the drop down menu and click User Defined Time Ranges. Here we can preview the current duration of our recording, the estimated file size, and the amount of free space left on the drive. Down here we can customize our user defined time ranges. For instance, we can set how long to pause between recordings, as well as set the recording time, which is currently 10 minutes, and how many repetitions we want. Here we see that there will be a 4 second pause between each recording of 5 seconds, and this process will be repeated twice. To add another time range, click Add Phase. In this range we have 1 second pause for every 2 seconds of recording to be repeated 4 times. The recording will begin from the top to the bottom, and the time ranges can be moved around by selecting them and clicking Move Down or Move Up. Additionally, time ranges can also be deleted by selecting them and clicking Remove Phase. When we have set our desired time ranges and are ready to begin recording, we can click OK. Click to begin the recording. And here we can see the time that is elapsing and how much time remains. Once our file has been opened and we move along the timeline, we can see that no data has been recorded for our specified pause duration. Then that data has been recorded for our specified 5 second interval. And then we had a recording pause. And then our interval again.